What's up, Parmaniacs? Parmastasis here. And today I'm going to show you guys how to install the Ether mod uh, installation into Minecraft. It's a little bit tricky, uh, and some of you guys who may not be familiar with doing some of this may need a little bit of help. So before we get started, you need to download MultiMC. This is a very easy program. It's free. You can get it online. Just Google MultiMC. I'll also have a link to where you can get this in the video description. Then you're going to need to download Ether. I'll have a link to the thread where you can get that. You need MC Player API Universal 1.5, and then you need MC Render Player API 1.0. Now this is for the alpha release that just released today on June 9th. Um, you, if you're watching this video a month from now or two months from now, obviously these versions are gonna be different. So what you wanna do first off is you wanna click over here, you wanna click Add New Instance. Now by default, it's gonna select the most current official release, which is 1.52. So we're just gonna name it right here, Ether YouTube. And you wanna click on Change Version, go down to 1.51, click OK. Then click OK again, and now you've got Ether YouTube. Right click on it, click Edit Mods. Now first off, we need to add Forge to it. Now Forge, has been updated obviously since this mod came out. Now since the mod is focusing on 1.51 we're going to go ahead and use 7.7.2.682. Click OK and it's going to download Forge. Once it's done that you want to click Add here and then you want to click uh, go to wherever your files are and you want to select Player API and Render API and then open both of those and it needs to be in this order. It needs to be Minecraft Forge, Player API, Render API. So once you've got these three all under the Minecraft jar tab, you want to click on the mods folder. Click add again and go to wherever you've got Ether installed or the Ether zip folder. Click that. Got all that done. Minecraft jar should look like this. Mods folder should look like that. Don't worry about core mods or texture packs. Click close. Double click. Make sure you enter your login information and it's going to download some stuff and then get uh, everything set up. But that should pretty much do it and get it all launched out. If you get some errors, either you're using the wrong version of API, the sort order is wrong, um, you've got the wrong version of Forge, using the wrong version of Minecraft, etc, etc. Just make sure that you check those. Like I said, this is for the alpha build that was released on June 9th. It's very possible if you're watching this video later that the versions have changed. The Ether website uh, release thread should show you which versions you need. For this version, the 1.51 version, this is what you need. This is the order. If you have any questions or you have any issues installing it, feel free to leave them in the video description below. I'll do my best to help. Um, you can also use their official forum over there, which I'll also link in the video description below. And select your little area that you want to use. You can use any of these that you like. I'm going to use the default Ether one. Go ahead and turn the music off. And there we go. That's how you install Ether. Anyways, hopefully you guys found this video helpful. If you did, please slap that like button. Make sure you subscribe, and I'll catch you guys in the next clip.